carbohydrates. These are the main sources of energy in our body. They are the most common component of our food. Few common sources of carbohydrates are potatoes, bananas, mangoes, cereals such as wheat and rice, sugar and honey. The presence of carbohydrates can be tested by the help of iodine solution. Let us perform an activity to test the presence of carbohydrates. Take a piece of raw potato and a grape. Pour 2 to 3 drops of iodine on them. You will observe the appearance of blue-black color on the potato slice. This shows that carbohydrates are present in potato. Proteins. They are complex body-building compounds. They regulate biochemical reactions in our body. They are required as constituents of cells and tissues. They are required for muscle contraction. Proteins also provide immune power to our body. Common sources of protein are fish, meat, egg, milk, peas, beans, cereals, etc. Let us perform an activity to test the presence of proteins. Take some sprouted beans and grind them in pestle and mortar. Keep the grinded seeds in a test tube and add a few drops of caustic soda on them. Now add a few drops of blue vitrol on it. You will observe that the color of the seeds changes to purple. This confirms the presence of proteins. Fats. They contain more amount of energy as compared to carbohydrates. Common sources of fats are cooking oils, ghee, butter, milk, cheese, mutton, egg yolk, etc. Milk, cheese, butter, egg and meat are animal fats, while oil extracted from almonds, groundnuts, mustards, sunflowers, etc. form vegetable fats. Let us perform an activity to test the presence of fat. Take a few groundnut seeds and rub them on the paper. You will observe oily stain on the paper. This confirms the presence of fats in the groundnut seeds. Vitamins and Minerals They are organic compounds needed by our body in small amounts. Vitamins are vital for metabolic functions of life and a healthy body. Fruits and vegetables are good sources of vitamins. Green leafy vegetables, fruits, eggs, fish, carrots, etc. are good sources of vitamin A. It is helpful to maintain healthy eyes and skin. Deficiency of vitamin A causes eye defects like night blindness. Meat, soya bean, green leafy vegetables, pea, potato, cereals, grains, tomato, etc. are good sources of vitamin B. It is essential for biochemical reactions. Deficiency of vitamin B causes beriberi. Gooseberry, lemon, orange and other citrus fruits are good sources of vitamin C. It is essential for immunity. Deficiency of vitamin C causes scurvy. Milk, fish and sun rays are good sources of vitamin D. It is essential for growth of bones. Deficiency of vitamin D causes rickets and osteomalacia. Green leafy vegetables, milk, butter, tomato, etc. are good sources of vitamin E. It is necessary to maintain the integrity of cells. Deficiency of vitamin E causes anemia. Vitamin K is synthesized during metabolism. It is important for blood clotting. Deficiency of vitamin K causes hemorrhage. Minerals are nutrients required by the body in minute amounts. They are also needed for the normal functioning of the body and good health. Milk, green vegetables, buttermilk and curd are good sources of calcium. It is essential for good health of bones. Meat, dry fruits and green leafy vegetables are good sources of iron. It is essential for synthesis of hemoglobin. Milk and green leafy vegetable are good sources of phosphorus. It is useful in formation of bones. Green vegetables and onion are good sources of sulfur. It is useful for development of tissues. Seafood and iodized salt are good sources of iodine. It is necessary for our growth. Deficiency Diseases 
consuming a diet lacking in nutrients results in deficiency or malnutrition. Malnutrition occurs when a diet deficient in any one of the nutrients is consumed. Deficiency of proteins causes marasmus and quashicor. Deficiency of iodine causes goiter. Deficiency of iron causes anemia. Deficiency of vitamins causes color blindness, anemia, allegra, beriberi, scurvy, rictus and bleeding. Water. It is required in large amounts by all living organisms. It forms about 65 to 70 percent of the human body weight. Average daily requirement of water is about 5 to 6 glasses. Water is required for biochemical reactions running within the body. It transports gases, nutrients and excretory substances in the body. It also helps in maintaining the temperature of the body. Balanced diet. For good health, it is not only important to include all the components in your diet, but it is also essential to include them in the right amount. A diet which contains all the nutrients in adequate amounts and in right proportion for the normal growth and development of our body is known as balanced diet. Balanced diet of a healthy person contains the nutritive components in the following proportions. Carbohydrates, about 55 to 75 percent of the diet. Proteins, about 15 percent of the diet. Fats, 10 to 25 percent of the diet. Water, 5 to 6 glasses per day. Minerals and vitamins, to be taken in small amount. 